So on Don TV today, I want to introduce a necklace and a chain that I did a while back. And I really like the simplicity of how it shines. And then you have a little color here. Um, but the message that I want to talk about on the show today is really simple. If there's something that you've never want, thought you would do or thought you could do and have a hobby, then you need to follow it. Because you never know. Your hobby could become your lifestyle. It could become your career. For me, my books and my jewelry line are just that. They're a brand. They're a part of my belief that people are unique and people are an individual. And as much as God created us all individually, we still can come together unity-wise. We can be one nation under God, like it says. But for me, it's about embracing you, you unique. So for me, it's about being an author and being a successful author. It's making jewelry once a week and eventually hoping to sell them for about $20, $25. Because there's a lot of time that goes into it. Um, because I can never recreate the same thing. And they are unique and they are one design. That's why I call my collection One Design. Check out my page on Facebook. Um, I have a page that shows all the jewelry I've done. And I've got over 30 pieces. Um, I could probably never duplicate this again. So I like it because it's an individual. But all my pieces together would make one um, nice collection. And, you know, would come together as one unity with so many different pieces. And like I said, I could never duplicate. So I hope you check out my Facebook page, Don's One Designs. Because like I said, they're, they're not reproduced. Once I do a design, that's it. I move on and I do another design. Nothing's ever the same. Um, my books are taking a little more direction. There's still faith and poetry, but I really do like fiction and testing the waters and kind of poking the bear, as you could say. I really look forward to expanding my brand, my books. I would love to be paid to be a blogger. Um... Reality TV has just gotten way out of hand. We need the old Sally Jesse Raphael and um, Phil Donahue and the Oprah's back and talk about real issues. Um, I turn 50 next month, and I think I look pretty good. But I really am trying to look forward at the next 50 years. And for me, that's being an author and making jewelry that I could sell and be proud of. And I'm really proud of this one. I really like this one. It's... It's me. So, have a good day.